Hello everyone. We'll continue with our next topic, which is different drawings and plans in electrical system design. So first of all, we'll see what do you mean by electrical drawings? What do you mean by electrical plans? <music> So electrical drawing shows required information for any engineering project. It is typically a technical drawing. An electrical drawing consists of lines, symbols, dimensions and notations to accurately convey an engineer's design to the worker. Now what do you mean by electrical plan? An electrical plan is illustrated by the top view showing the physical location of the equipment. Now, different drawings and plans in electrical system design. So, the first one is single line diagram, second is power plan, next is elementary diagram, fourth one is interconnection diagram, and the last lightning plan. So, let's see one by one. Single line diagram. Single line diagram represents how the power is distributed from source to the end user. It is a simplified notation for representing a three phase power system. Electrical elements such as transformer, circuit breaker, bus bar are shown by the standard symbols. And instead of representing each of the three phases with separate line, only one conductor is being represented. That's why it makes the diagram much simpler to understand. The diagram indicates voltage level, bus capacity, fuse or breaker rating, key metering and identification which will help in describing electrical distribution. So as you can see all the elements are being shown in the one single diagram which makes it easier to understand this with the symbol on the right hand side. Next is power plan. This diagram is physical plan which is drawn to scale. It shows the location of all motors and other electrical loads and how they are fed. Cable and conduit size are also indicated in the power plan. If the project is large, separate diagrams are often used to list the conduit and cable size. Next is elementary diagram, also known as ladder diagram. In this diagram indicates how the system is to be controlled and the typical controlling devices such as push button, limit switch, level switch and pressure switch are shown which are used on the input side and are used to energize relay, motor control coil and solenoid wall which are the at the output side. The diagram indicate how the system operates. Next is interconnection diagram. Elementary diagram is used as a basis for this diagram. All the relays are shown in their relative position. Terminal number and point to point connections are shown as you can see in the diagram. This drawing is used by electrician to connect the wire to each terminal. Interconnection diagram shows connection from one device to another as well as the detail of connection of each device. Next is lightning plan. Lightning plan is illustrated by the top view of physical location showing all lightning fixtures and other electrical lightning load. This is drawn to scale and shows actual location of the lightning equipment. Conduit and cable for lighting are also physically shown in the lightning plan. So these were all the drawings and plans used in electrical system design. So that's all for this video. Thank you.